Hello, it's Markham Matosh here from Markham 3D, and today we're going to be doing a very quick guide of getting Character Creator 3 straight into Unreal Engine projects. So I've already got Character Creator 3 open. Let's start the process of installing the plugin for Unreal Engines. Click Plugins at the top, Character Creator icon Setup, get the tool for Unreal Engine. From here, let's scroll down to the download. Let's download this puppy. And then once we've downloaded, we click on it and go through the usual of yes, 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 next, 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 put it wherever you want. Now, if you're starting off with a very fresh build of Unreal Engine 4, you don't really have to do anything. However, if you're upgrading from a previous version, make sure you follow the instructions at the bottom of that page to delete everything that it's required. So once we finish installing, we came up with this folder. Let's open up these. As we're using 4.24, I'm going to select all this and click and drag it and put it into my project folder. And now you can see we've got some extra folders. However, let's close the project and reopen the project. We can now see we've got CC set up at the top. So let's just make sure we've got the right things enabled by going to plugins we can actually see that we've got a message down the bottom here and we can see that it's also enabled you little ripper back into character creator we're going to go file export fbx fully clothed let's change it from blender which i just did before to unreal engine i'm just going to go the mesh and i'm going to click export and what i'm going to do is i'm going to save it somewhere and there we go now it's saving from here let's just get frankie and put it in Let's make sure use T0 as pose reference is enabled. Let's come up here into skeleton, select our skeleton, and it's going to be the UE4 mannequin selection. Let's come down into material, and we want the import method to be do not create materials and do not import textures because this is all done through the character creator plugin. Let's now click import all. And now we've got our Frankie with no skeleton attached to it. However, if we pick the default character in here already, we can come down to the mesh, change a skeletal mesh to Frankie and we need to make sure that the third person anime blueprint C is selected and now if we press play look at that what a character already in Unreal Engine 4 and look how beautiful it looks what did I do squat and it just worked if you want to see more videos like this please make sure you like and subscribe to the channel it really helps me out keeps you up to date with the content and if there's anything else you want to see please let me know